God's Wisdom Revealed Through the Spirit Friends, when I came and told you the mystery that God had shared with us, I didn't use big words or try to sound wise. In fact, while I was with you, I made up my mind to speak only about Jesus Christ who had been nailed to a cross. At first, I was weak and trembling with fear. When I talked with you or preached, I didn't try to prove anything by sounding wise. I simply let God's Spirit show His power. That way you would have faith because of God's power and not because of human wisdom. We do use wisdom when speaking to people who are mature in their faith, but it isn't the wisdom of this world or of its rulers who will soon disappear. We speak of God's hidden and mysterious wisdom that God decided to use for our glory long before the world began. The rulers of this world don't know anything about this wisdom. If they had known about it, they wouldn't have nailed the glorious Lord to a cross. But it is just as the Scriptures say, What What God God has has planned planned for people who love him him is more than than eyes have seen or ears have heard. It has never even entered our minds. God's Spirit has shown you everything. His Spirit finds out everything, even what is deep in the mind of God. You are the only one who knows what is in your own mind, and God's Spirit is the only one who knows what is in God's mind. But God has given us His Spirit. This is why we don't think the same way that the people of this world think. This is also why we can recognize the blessings God has given us. Every word we speak was taught to us by God's Spirit, not by human wisdom. And this same Spirit helps us teach spiritual things to spiritual people. This is why only someone who has God's Spirit can understand spiritual blessings. Anyone who doesn't have God's Spirit thinks these blessings are foolish. People who are guided by the Spirit can make all kinds of judgments, but they can't be judged by others. The Scriptures ask, Has anyone ever known the thoughts of the Lord or given him advice? But we understand what Christ is thinking.